Hey everyone, this is Charles Mitri from LoungeBoudoir.com and today I'm going to do a uh, package opening from LensRentals.com. I've been renting some lenses recently. I thought it would be a good idea to show you their whole process. So you go online, LensRentals.com, and you can choose the lens you want. I rented a zoom lens. I'm, I've got a shoot coming up a couple of days and I wanted to see what it was like to just have one lens on my camera. Usually I'm switching between my 18 to 35 Nikkor and then a 50 millimeter prime. So I wanted to see what it was like to just have one lens on my camera. It arrives FedEx. You get this nice box here and it's all taped. So we're going to open this up here and be careful when you open the box because you're going to use this box to ship it back, ship it back later on. So. So it comes in this nice case here, this nice hard case. I mean, you could chuck this down the, down the stairs and whatever's inside is not gonna break. Uh, it says lens rentals on it. And um, it's got these two latches here. So what you do is underneath here, it's got these two spring, spring levers. You pull them towards you and it pops up. This is what it looks like inside. They give you a return shipping label. Uh, they even give you a big piece of tape, two pieces of tape to secure the box with when you ship ship it back. This is all padded. Got your lens pouch in here, and this is all padded here. Pretty safe. It's all messed up. And it's packed even more. It's got this uh, kind of packaging here. The uh, lens hood came off, but it goes like that. So I'll put that there. This is the uh, Tokina uh, 24 to 70 2.8. And this is a happy lens. Um, I'm sure it's over two pounds. 24 to 70, there's a lot of glass in here. It was rated highest on, I forget the name of the website, but it's like DX something. I'll put a link in the description below. Can they? They rate all these lenses and camera bodies. This got better ratings than the Nikkor, Nikon 24-70, better than the uh, Sigma, and I think one other brand that they tested as far as sharpness goes and just overall quality. Build quality is amazing. Anyway, back to lens rental. As you can see, it's not gonna be damaged when it arrives. When you're done with it, you pack it all up, so I put this back here, put the lens, put it back here, put this back the pouch, you know, put this back here. Press that, put back the box. Then you secure it with this tape, this tape here. And then this shipping label that they give you goes right over the one that got it here. And that is it. So um, I am an affiliate for Lens Rental, so I get a small commission if you rent through my link, which uh, I would greatly appreciate. That's great, it's like 5%. But um, I, like, I like them a lot. Uh, there's another company that is also on my website, but um, I haven't rented from them yet because they haven't had the lenses that I needed. So I'm kind of switching teams here. Um, lens rentals, I, you know, it appears to me, don't you know, quote me on this, they have a wider selection, but they, they have the lenses that I've wanted. Um, it's great. You just open an account and you mark how many days you want it for. They don't count the shipping day and they don't count the day that you ship it. So if I get a, a one day, a two day rental or something, one day rental, two day rental, you actually might have it for three days. I mean, this arrived early. This, this is, uh, what's today? Today is Saturday. And this wasn't supposed to arrive till Tuesday. And then I shoot on Wednesday, and then I return it on Thursday. So that's kind of cool. Um, I'm not actually going to use it before then, but uh, something to think about. And that's it. So if you like this video, uh, give it a thumbs up or subscribe, or do both. You know, you can like it and subscribe. I appreciate it. Check out all the articles on Boudoir on loungeboudoir.com and I will see you at a future point in the YouTube universe.